so i'll be showing you how i created this vlog intro, intro in, using CapCut. if you just join me for the first time hit the subscribe button put on the post notification bell so you get notified when i post new video here on youtube okay let's just get right to it so the first thing we'll be doing is i'll come to my new project so i'll just bring in the pictures the images i want for the video okay so i'll bring in this one first i'll bring in this one next okay i'll take this one next take this one oh sorry take this one next and bring in this one so you just select the number of videos you want so i'll just okay i'll add this to it all right so i will just hide okay now with this one done so i'll just try and trim the video to three seconds you can see beside these two days tiny dots there okay i'll just come here and um split so i'll just delete that side there it was three three seconds and split then delete this now the transition effect on this particular video i mean the color the color coloring of this particular image is very poor split delete so the same thing applies to everything it's worth it. split delete Now this is 15, 16, 17, okay, 18. Delete. Alright, so don't forget to delete that cap cut and the that just I just now this one I just the this part this particular image. Now this one I just the this part this particular image. I just felt the uh, the color adjustment is very, very poor. So I'll come here and I'll just add to the contrast. I'll click on contrast. I'll add to it. Okay, so I will I will increase. Let me add to the saturation. Let me sharpen the image. So I'm thinking of increasing the brightness. Now we look at it. Some of those colors are already popping out. Okay. So, okay, when I take the temperature to this now, you can see the blues are coming out. Those white parts, let's see, okay, those blue parts, okay now all right so i'll just keep this one like this so we'll just look at the image of what we've done let's see how many minutes about three minutes so the next thing is that we bring in our overlay just click on any outer part or just click on the overlay just add the overlay and i will try and locate the overlay that i want to make use of i have many of this overlay here so i'll just bring in this one instead it's about 11 minutes okay let me use one about 17 seconds 11 seconds sorry let me use one about of 17 seconds okay now the same thing works for everything so i'll just add this one inside instead so it's taking a while if you're joining me for the first time hit the subscribe button put on the post notification bell so you get notified whenever i post this tutorial on youtube so let's just get over with this and tweeting, tweeting is taking time. Voila, we have this. So I'll use my two fingers to just kill the video. So I'll just I'll try and play it. It's perfect. So since the video, the transition ended here, so I'll just like shift my video to that to end there. So this is by 
transition my my image i just selected on it so i'll come to cut out i'll click the chroma key then i'll just the color picker i'll set it on this side on this side here this green then i'll click on okay now you just need to maybe the, the transition i'm sending maybe having seen some like gray matter after you've done the transition just position it here because those gray parts and that green part will just disappear together so i'll come here increase the intensity to about 20. now this is so you can see those side of the those side of green that i'm talking about that's what i'm talking about it so just put it somewhere around here so then i'll come to so adjust so i'll come to uh hl hsl use saturation and luminous slide so i'll come to the green i'll reduce the saturation and i'll increase the luminous so this is me getting rid of those green side that may pop up Okay, now the original videos I will not send you these videos I'm using, but however I know I'll send you where I downloaded it, so you can just go there and pick. They are free. You can download as many as you like. That will be better. I downloaded Pixels and Unsplash.com. I'll give you the direct link to where the videos are. So I'll come here and increase the slide. Then I'll just increase my bit rate, or I can just put situation somewhere around here and and okay so create now i can just so i'll just come here click on export so now it's exporting more or less so that's all for this particular tutorial so we'll see in the next video so it is done processing rendering so this is my video my final video or you can just go to where it is my final video. So let me just or you can when saving you can try and save in one um, um, 1080p. So now when I saved it as this thing, the size was very big. So I'm just taking it to video panel to crush the size. But it's done. I will just go to my file manager and I should see it somewhere in my camera. Alright, so this is it. It's about six, six megabytes. Alright, so I'll just crush it using Video Panda. It should just reduce the size to about 10 megabytes. So, we'll see you in the next video.